Annotations. The following table summarizes all known annotations to OCT 01-4 through 1957. Any land titles not annotated here injured to this day remain, for the Agana decision with compromise agreement, for the benefit of the Filipino people, under the administration of the Don Esteban Benetis Talano and Don Gregoria Madrigal Acap Foundation. Annotation entry number, description, date of inscription. Annotation entry number, EDC slash 014 slash S1720. Description, in support with the installation of Cornerstone for the Santa Rosa Church in Manila, Francisco de la Custa, Archbishop of Manila, acquired 1-1 hectare from King Luis de Guillentalano in a form of donation allowing the construction of the Santa Rosa Church in the subject lot. Signed, Archbishop Francisco de la Custa, Governor Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription, September 12, 1720. Annotation entry number, EDC slash 003 slash S-10-25 slash 1762. Description, the Spanish government officials and residents of the Philippine Islands are compelled to take the oath of allegiance to King George III of the Royal Government of England with the order from the King the absolute cancellation of OCT number 01-4 in the name of King Philip II of Spain. The same land title should be issued anew to and in the name of Prince Lacana Cunita Lanota Gion. Signed. Simon Andere Salazar, Governor-General Royal of the Crown of Spain. Date of inscription October 25, 1762. Annotation entry number, Bra slash 022 slash S 1762. Description, British Royal Squadron led by British Governor Downson Drake, through this land title. They registered their strong words and proclamation over the repossession of the Isla Filipinas Hacienda Filipinas through the royal order of the king and the OCT number 01-4 averted the subject land and relona, Prince Lacana Cunita Lanota Gion, the cousin of the British Lord Alfred Dent. The stronger force of the British squadron supported by heavy artillery's demand for the immediate surrender of the Spanish government inasmuch as they occupied the Church of Malati, Ermita, San Juan de Bagumbayan, San Chiago and Strategic Spanish Military Camp. Signed, Archbishop Manuel Rojo del Rio, Governor General Royal of the Crown of Spain. Date of inscription September 23rd or 25th, 1762. Annotation entry number, EDC slash 029 slash S-10-6 slash 1762. Description register on the land title OCT number 01-4 The Falls of Manila. Cavity, Laguna and the province of Moran to the British forces the force the Spanish government indemnified the troops for P4 million point zero zero, the same year the subject land and its ownership, by the order of the Royal King of England, had reverted to Prince Lacan of Cunita Guillentalano, the cousin of the British Lord Alfred Dent. Signed, Simon B. Andere Salazar. Governor-General. Date of inscription, October 6, 1762. Annotation entry number, RAM 031 slash ED 00022 slash 1565 war cancelled by the century slash the 25th of October 1764. Description. British Royal Crown ordered the cancellation of title OCT 01-4 in the name of King Philip II, and ordered registered a new OCT to the original landowner's heir, 
Prince Lakana Kunitalano, in lieu of previous one, on January 7, 1764, and implement the order of justice of re Lordinsha de Manila. Simon de Anda confirmed the land hacienda Filipina ownership in favor of the heir of King Louis Andiguin, Prince Lacan Acunitiguin Talano, who won the cash embodied in RAM 571 on January 22, 1761 in accord with the peace treaty between the Royal Crown of England and Spanish government on October 2, 1764 as implemented by British Governor of the date of inscription, January 7, 1764. Philippines, Downsend Rake. Signed, Governor Jose Raron, Proprietary Governor. Annotation entry number AM006 slash S1784. Description, upon recognition of the Roman Catholic Church hierarchy in the Philippine Islands over the lawful rights of King Louis Andiguian Talano and his heir over Hacienda Filipina, Bishop Salazar sent a message to the King of Spain containing the account of tyranny, oppression and forfeiture of land of the inhabitants by the encomenderous. The King of Spain issued an order directing the members of the colonial government to prevent such inhumane conduct to the Filipinos and the confiscated land by the friars should be reverted to the Tagian Talano clans. Signed, Gonzalo Ranquillo de Penaloza, Governor General of the Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription September 17, 1583. Annotation entry number, RAM 040, S 1784. Description, on the account of the complaint of the Haitian Dero landowner Prince Lacan Acunita Guintalano, Spanish Governor General Jose Basco E. Vargas promulgates decree prohibiting seizure of farmers' land caribous, and farm implements by the creditors as well as the farmers torturing, arrest and imprisonment for non-payment of debts in as much as land tilled by the farmers are owned by Prince Lacan of Cunitagui and Talano evidence. By the SOCT 01-4, signed, Jose Basco y Vargas, Governor General Royal Spanish Crown. Date of inscription November 15. 1794. Annotation entry number, RAM 061-S-6-24, 1784. Description operator and lessee of Hacienda Maya League, Father Huandi Matter, by Royal Ordensia, after if acquired the 10,000 square meter portion of the estate. Hacienda Maya League, from the real landowner, Prince Julian MacLeod Talano, in the form of conditional donation had established, and constructed Hospital de San Lozero. Signed, O.C. Basco y Vargas Governor General Royal Spanish Crown. Date of inscription June 24, 1784. Annotation number. RAM 041, S1784. Description The Real Compania de Filipinas was established with a capital stock of P3,000,000 in 32,000 shares at P250,000 each, and secured by this land title OCT01-4. In the name of Prince Lacan Acunitagian. Signed. OCD Basco y Vargas Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription March 10, 1785. Annotation entry number, RAM 042, S-1786. 
Description cancellation of entry RAM 041S1785 after full payment of P10 million point zero zero loan obligation of landowner and his business associates. Date of the document March 10th, 1786. Signed, Jose de Basco y Vargas Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription March 14th. 1786. Annotation entry number RDC 059-S1116802. Description Don Luis Rocha, the uncle of the first cousin of Prince Lacanata Guintalano, sold Malacanang the summer house along the Pasig River to Colonel Don Jose Miguel Fermento without the authority of the heirs of the Talano. Signed, Rafael Maria de Aguilera Ponce de Leon Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription November 16, 1802. Annotation entry number AM042-S-4-3-1000 Description a deed of irrevocable donation executed by Prince Julian MacLeod to La Nota Guillen to permit the location and construction and to Densha building along Vito Cross St. and Manila Botanical Garden. Signed, Juan Antonio Martinez Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription April, 1823. Annotation entry number EDC 0100 slash S4 Description of petition filed in the Royal Ordincia de Manila by Prince Lacanata Guintalano against a treaty incorporating the Sula Sultanate into the Royal Crown of Spain on the reason that said land of the Sultanate form part of the archipelago evidence by Royal Decree 01-4 Protocol own, and in the name of the King Louis Antiguian Talano, the predecessor of Prince Lacantiguian. Date of instrument April 24, 1851. Escribania de Cabal de Bay, signed, Governor Antonio de Urbis Tondo y Equia. Date of inscription April 25, 1851. Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Annotation entry number EDC 067-S8-1-1851. Description loan of P1 million point zero zero from Banco Central de Espana, secured by 1,000 hectares in Tagig, portion of the Talano estate originally owned by the late Prince Lacan Acuna Talano which he secured said loan, and he paid the 508 of the 4,000. Shares of the newly organized Spanish Filipino Bank. The first Filipino banking institution in the Philippine Islands. Signed, Antonio de Urbis Tondo y Equia Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription August 1, 1851. Annotation number, EDC 059, 9-17-18. Description Reverend Francisco C. Gaines received 1 1 hectare from the Judicial Administrator of Talano to GN Estate, Isla Gino Benitez, located in Nuba Casillas, to locate and permit the construction of the newly founded Colegio de Santa Recibal. Signed, Carlos Maria de la Torn Avicera de Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription September 15, 1870. Annotation entry number EDC S-9-42-1871. Description a deed of donation of 2,000 square meters situated in Paco, Manila has been granted by the heirs of the Talanus to the Sister of Charity for the relocation of San Teresable College which was founded in the year 1634 Hermanda de la Misericordia, 
and had turned over to Sister of Charity. Signed, Rafael de Izuardo y Gutierrez Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription September 11, 1871. Annotation entry number EDCS-9-12-1871. Description cancellation of entry number EDC-067-S8-1-1871 and full redemption of 1,000 hectares of land upon full payment of the principal loan of P1,000,000 plus interest of P2,000,000. Signed, Rafael de Izuardo y Gutierrez Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription August 10, 1871. Annotation entry number EDCS-3-11-1876. Description of protocol signed by England and Germany recognizes Spanish rights to the Tawny Tawny group of islands and the chain of islands stretching from Sulu to Borneo, which was protested by Prince Julian MacLeod Tolano, the owner of the islands up to North Borneo and Turtle Islands as evidenced by land title OCT01-4 and embodied in peace treaty between England and Spain on October 24. 1764, the same rights through the recommendation of Royal Crown of England based on evidence OCT 01-4 has been relinquished to the said landowner, Prince Lacan Acunita Guillain-Tolano and his heir, Prince Julian MacLeod Tolano. Signed, Jose Malcampo y Mons Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription March 10, 1876. Annotation entry number AM057-S-1-22-1871. Description An Austrian businessman and Alfred Den organized North Borneo Company as the American trading company collapse. A deed of lease agreement between Sultan of Sulu and the North Borneo Company represented by the cousin of Prince Julian MacLeod to Lano signed for annual lease of U.S. Dollar 5000.00 ending January 22, 1978, after which the land should be reverted to the cousin, Prince Julian MacLeod to Lano to Gion while the lease payment including the land area of North Borneo, to be divided among the for beneficiaries, 75% to the Kiram Zezan, 25% to the Talano Zez. Signed, Domingo Mirian Zemurillo Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription January 22, 1878. Annotation entry number EDC 063-S-7-31-1887. Description the installation of the cornerstone of the two tuban Manila Railroad Station of the Manila Railroad Colle by Governor Terrero, assisted by 17 years old Don Esteban Benitez to Lano to Gian and his administrator cousin, Attorney Higino Benitez who leased three hectares of land to the MRRC for the project and the amount of P300.00 monthly, which will expire on July 31, 1967. Signed, Emilio Terrero y Perrin at Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription July 20, 1887. Annotation entry number EDC 072-S-1-02-1890. Description the first installment amounting of 400,000.00 US dollars paid by General Primo de Rivera out of agreed consideration and damages over the millions of fruits. Pale and sugar cane crops forfeited annually by the Spanish government from the Hacienda Filipina owned by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano, 
the son of the late Prince Julian MacLeod Talano, evidenced by OCT number 01-4 and as one of the conditions in the Pact of Bayaknabato, and remitted to the revolutionary government, through Hong Kong Bank, to buy guns and ammunitions. Signed, Sermon Juadim Z. Alvarez ad interim Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Date of inscription January 3, 1898. Annotation entry number EDC 073 slash S-2-6 slash 1898. Description secured by this title. OCT number T-01-4. Hacienda Mabiga embracing the whole province of Pampanga, Kilias, the whole of Bamban and Capaz. Tulac has a mortgage to the Banco Espinal. Date of inscription. February 7th, 1898. eighteen ninety eight Filipino, the sum in US dollars twenty million point zero zero to undertake the payment of secession treaty between Spain and America for the ceding of the archipelago by the Spanish government to the American government, be reverted to the real landowner, Don Esteban Benitez Talano. Date of document February second, eighteen ninety eight. Signed, Sermon Juadim Z. Alvarez ad interim Governor General Royal Crown of Spain. Annotation entry number EDC 074 S 2 7 1899. Description entry number EDC 073 S 2 6 1898. Real estate mortgage amounting to US dollars twenty million point zero zero secured by this land title OCT number T-01-4 embracing the area of Hacienda Mabiga, Pampanga, Kilias, and Capaz. Tulac the Banco Espinal Filipino has been cancelled and this released forever of real estate mortgage has been executed by the Bank in favor of the owner with the full payment of said principal loan and an interest of U.S. dollar two million point zero zero, the payment of which has broken as follows: General Miguel Malva correspondingly acquired the area of Tanoan, Batangas, and had paid the account of U.S. dollar three million three hundred thousand point zero zero. Don Servalano Aquino acquired the whole area of Bamban and Capaz. Tulac and correspondingly paid the amount the sum of US. Dollar three million three hundred thousand point zero zero. General Antonio Luna acquired the whole San Miguel, Tulac and La Paz. Tulac and he paid the account of US. Dollar two million point zero zero. The land was given as a gift to his girlfriend, Miss Luisita Cohuanco. Don Mariano Teag acquired the area of Kilias and Mabaga 1500 hectares. Pampanga correspondingly paid the amount, the sum of US. $3,300,000.00. Don Francisco Macabulus acquired the area of Star, Ignatia. Tulak and had paid correspondingly the account, the sum of US. Dollar two million four hundred thousand point zero zero. Don Juan Ejacito acquired absolutely the San Juan del Monte Hacienda embracing up to Sitio Mandaluayan consisting an area of three thousand one hundred and fifty four hectares, and correspondingly paid the account in US. Dollar three million three hundred thousand point zero zero and Don Esteban Benitez Talano to Gian maintained his rights being the owner over the unacquired estate, and had paid the balance of six million six hundred thousand point zero zero US dollar. Signed, Benitol Ligada ad interim land registrar. Date of inscription February seventh, eighteen ninety nine. 
Annotation entry number CLR 0096 S-6-21 1901 Description of civil case slash CLRO number PC 032 An opposition complaint against the civil governor William H. Taft to purchase track of lands from any religious order on the basic grounds that the said lands and the hanks of the religious orders are merely donations of the Talanotagian clan owner of Hacienda Filipina slash Hacienda Quebega and Hacienda Mahalik, that any violation of said donation, the land should be reverted to the true owner, heir of late Prince Julian MacLeod Talano, Don Esteban Benitez Talano, signed, Lukey Wright Governor General, USA. Date of inscription June 21, 1901. Annotation entry number EDC 096-S1900. Description real estate mortgage executed by Don Esteban Benitez Delano secured by 260 hectares of commercial lot in Centro Intramuros, in a Banco Filipino Espanol for the sum of P1,500,000.00. The said sum received by Messrs. H. G. Serres and Carson Taylor for the establishment of Manila Daily Bulletin. Date of the document February 3, 1902. Signed, H. K. Sleeper Land Registration Officer. Date of inscription November 13, 1902. Annotation Entry Number 097-S1900 Description Cancellation of Entry Number RDC 096-S1900 Upon full payment of the real estate mortgage the sum of P1,750,000.00 and said real estate had released to the owner. Date of Document February 4, 1903 Signed, H. K. Sleeper Land Registration Officer. Date of inscription February 10, 1903. Ch. Annotation entry number CLR 0107, S1903. Description lease agreement entered between Don Esteban Benitez Talano, landowner slash lessor and father Gregorio Lugo Chrysostomo of Milalis. Bulocan, let's see, over an area of 3,750 hectares situated in Cabanachan and Santa Rosa, Nuva Resiger, portion of Hacienda Filipina owned originally by Prince Lacantigian Talano and Prince Julian MacLeod Talano, predecessors of Don Esteban Benitez Talano. In the sum of P20,000.00 annually, to facilitate the sugar plantation project of the left sea, for the purpose of increasing sugar exportation to USA and Brazil as allocated to the Philippines. The conditions are, that the left sea may donate only the use of fructs for charity purposes, and disallowing for the reassignment of the land to any without consent of the landowner. Date of inscription February 11, 1903. The term of lease should expire on the year 2003 or this agreement shall automatically be nullified, be declared null and void upon violation of the lessee to any of the conditions set forth or immediately upon the death of the lessee. The subject land should be automatically surrendered by the beneficiaries slash farmers to the landowner even without a demand. Otherwise an appropriate civil-slash-criminal prosecution should be lodged by the landowner against any intruder or any party who has taken advantage of the opportunity over the land in the absence of both lessor and lessee. Date of document February 6, 1903. Signed, H. K. Sleeper Land Registration Officer. Annotation entry number P.L.A.-061-S-6-21-1901.
1903 Description deed of assignment absolutely conveyed to Sultanate of Sulu on their Jamal al -Kiramaz. Relative Don Esteban Benitez Talano, the whole lands of the province of Sulu, Lanao, Cotabato and Zambonga in favor of the Filipino Muslim brothers and sisters, to prevent escalation of hostilities in Mindanao, in compliance to the order of Philippine Commission headed by William Howard Taft. Date of document June 10, 1903. Signed. William Howard Taft Philippine Commission by Public Land Authority. Date of inscription June 19, 1903. Annotation entry number CLRO. Description to Motiapes, the second cousin of Juan Ramos Talano, son of Don Esteban Benitez Talano, landowner, after acquiring lot located at Tondo. Reserve it for the monument of Dr. Hosi Ressel in the form of donation from Sedon Esteban Benitez Talano, redonated the same for the relocation of the National Heroes Monument in Tondo. Date of document November 10, 1903. Signed, H. Casley Land Registration Officer. Date of inscription December 3, 1903. Annotation entry number EDCS 1, 7, 1904. Description the lease agreement over the Mapaga area the Stadsenberg camp embracing an area of 7,500 hectares, that 5,000, 5,000 of which is owned by the Talano, and that 1,500, 1,500 hectares is owned by Don Marciano Teag, between the Talano. Tayag and the U.S. Government in the sum of U.S. dollar twenty thousand point zero zero yearly or annually paid of ten years advance amounting of U.S. dollar twenty thousand point zero zero extended by U.S. Governor General to the Philippines Luke Wright who represented the U.S. Government. Date of document January 7, 1904. Signed, H. Casely Land Registration Officer. Date of inscription January 14, 1904. Annotation entry number CLR 01122, S1904. Description a deed of donation of one hectare lot in San Miguel. Manila has been executed by Don Esteban Benitez Talano in favor of Donia Liberida Avalino to locate finally the school. Centro Escola de Senoritas now Centro Escola University, as a birthday gift to the lady, that became his girlfriend for years. Date of document January 18, 1904. Signed, H. Casely Palan Registration Officer. Date of inscription January 20th, 1904. Annotation entry number CLR 10, S-475. Description this land evidence by OCT number T-01-4 has been placed for adjustment under appropriate court proceeding in accordance with LRA 496 of 1902 to find the permissibility of the area, and it has been recorded under court land registration case 475. Decree number. 297 of October 3, 1904 per record book of decree, book number 1, embracing the entire archipelago up to Turtle Island, Spratly, an island of Sabah North Borneo, which ended appropriately in favor of the original owner, Prince Lacan Acunita Guintalano, married to Princess Raulina Maria Elizabeth Overbeck Macleod the predecessor of Prince Julian Macleod. Talano for the period of two two years court battle, to wit. In view thereof, 
The Court of Land Registrations found in due course with probative value said land title OCT number T-01. Dash, for embracing the subject archipelago for, and in the name of Price Lacken Acunita Gian, married to Princess Rowena Maria Elizabeth Overbeck MacLeod of Austria, who was. Date of inscription October 10, 1904. Naturalized under the laws of the Philippine Commission as Filipino citizen. Now, therefore, by virtue of the public land laws of the country dismissing the appeal of the government in his highest tribunal, a corresponding decree 297, October 3, 1904, embracing the whole archipelago has been granted and be appended to the said OCT number T-01-4 as a matter of proprietary rights of the said registered landowner, that should embrace to be titled to the land forever, adapted thereto, the Torren system of the Royal Kingdom of Switzerland, to establish social peace and order in every island and haciendas like Philippines. Date of document October 3rd. 1904. Signed, H. Casley Palan Registration Officer. Annotation entry number CLR 092, S-11-17, 1909. Description a deed of absolute sale executed by the owner, Don Esteban Benitez Tolano over an area 1,200 hectares in favor of Matia Quirino, portion of 7,500 hectares in Baguio owned by the vendor, that has been leased to the U.S. Government at a yearly lease payment of U.S. $40,000.00 paid to Don Esteban Benitez Tolano, to accommodate the installation of U.S. Military camp known as Camp John Hay. Date of document November 4, 1904. Signed, H. Casley Palan Registration Officer. Date of inscription November 17, 1904. Annotation entry number CLR 092 5-20-1909 sick. Description Acting Governor General W. Cameron Forbes, brother-in-law of Don Esteban Benitez Tolano, succeeded to acquire a deed of donation for a lot consisting of 10,000 square meter in Ermita, Manilato permit the laying of cornerstone of the proposed legislative building. Date of the document May 4, 1909. Signed. H. Casley Palan Registration Officer. Date of inscription May 21, 1909. Annotation entry number GLR 0198-S1923. Description a deed of assignment over one hectare of land in Plaza in Tramuras in favor of his cousin, Don Luis Versosa of Dingras, Elicus Norti. Executed by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano to construct the house of the Versosa in the newly declared Plaza Lawton. Signed, Eulalio Garcia Register of Deeds. Date of inscription May 4, 1923. Annotation entry number GLR 01121-S1925. Description deed of absolute sale in favor of Don Feliciano Nevis, married to Donia Dalo Ruiz Rojas, executed by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano, covering 2,500 hectares in Desmarinus Cavity for the full payment P2,500,000.00. Signed, Eulalio Garcia Register of Deeds. Date of inscription March 20th. 1925.
Annotation entry number RPA 01 to 7 slash S dash 1 dash 27 slash 1938. Description Jose Ulo, compadre of Don Esteban Benitez Tolano, landowner, acquired 1515 hectares of land amounting P150,000 in Calamba. Laguna by way of installment sale for a period of two years at equal monthly installments. Signed, Hosi 2 Paz Register of Deeds. Date of inscription January 24, 1938. Annotation entry number GLR 0127, S1938. Description deed of absolute sale executed by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano in favor of Don Emilio Ejacito and spouse, Donia Mary Marcelo Ejacito, over an area of 3,000 hectares situated in Valenzuela and Mikoyan, Bulocan, with the lot 500 hectares in Tagate, Cavity for full payment of the sum of P. 3,500,000.00 Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds Date of inscription April 19, 1938 Annotation entry number GLR 130, S 1938 Description a deed of absolute sale in favor of engineer Amon Magsaysay over an area of 700 hectares in Tagate, Batangas executed by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano for the full payment of P1,400,000.00. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription June 14, 1938. GLRO-131, S-1938. Description a deed of absolute sale for the sum of P2,000,000 which is fully paid over an area of 2,000 hectares in Tate, Rethel executed by Don Esteban Benitez Tolano. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription September 7, 1939. Annotation entry number, GLR 0101, S-5-5-1939. Description in conjunction with the establishment of the University of the Philippines and the place thereof from Manila to Diliman, embodied under Act Number. 1870, and in the honor of his cousin Conrado Benitez and a tribute to his second cousin, late Ignacio Villamor, its first president, Don Esteban Benitez Tolano extended a deed of donation of around 75-75 hectares of land in Diliman district for the permanent location of University of the Philippines. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription May 5, 1939. GLRO-0105, S-7-3-1941. Description reported in this office, and inscribed in the land title OCT number OCTT-01-4. That Spratly and Turtle Islands, explored by Dr. H. F. Bain, Mining Affairs Advisor to the Philippine Commonwealth, and after conducting an oil drilling activities over the area, which are part of this archipelago, large deposits of high-grade oils were discovered suitable for commercial use. While in the area at 75 kilometers southeast of Mindanao, a large undeterminable volume of deuterium found within the area of the archipelago. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription July 4, 1941. GLRO-079, 
S-4-7-1946. Description Letter of Declaration Respecting Private Rights of Don Esteban Benitez Talano, heir of the late Prince Julian MacLeod Talano over the 7,169 islands of the archipelago including the Freedom Island, Turtle Islands and Sabar Islands evidenced by OCT No. T-01. Dash 4 in consonance with the Declaration of U.S. President Harry S. Truman with U.S. Congress Joint Resolution No. 39 of June 29, 1946 and the December 10, 1898 Treaty of Paris, that United States withdraws and surrender all rights of possession including lands and supervision, jurisdiction, control of sovereignty, and recognized the independence of the Philippines. Date of document June 7, 1946. Signed, Manuel A. Rojas Philippine President. Date of inscription July 5, 1946. Annotation entry number RPA 0181-S3-121946. Description Another manifestation of opposition lodged under Rural for Progress Administration Case No. 137, by Don Esteban Benitez Talano through his lawyer, Attorney Claro N. Recto against President Osmina's executive order creating the National Urban Planning Commission for Urban Development throughout the Philippines, which may adversely damage the estate owned by the oppositor. In compliance to the Treaty of Paris on December 10, 1898 respecting private property, His Excellency President Sergio Osmina issued a directive that the government has agreed to pay any amount of damage sustained by the estate. The sum of P21,500,000.00 had been released by the National Treasury through the order of President Osmina in the account of damage suffered by several lots in Diliman and Marukina, and particularly the uprooted fruit-bearing mango trees in Antipalo and Cavite due to the negligence of the public works and highways in the implementation of infrastructure works. Signed. Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription March 1, 1947. Annotation entry number LA-0911 S-2-1947. Description manifestation of opposition by the landowner. Don Esteban Benitez Talano Lodge under Land Authority 09-47. Through his lawyer, Attorney Claro N. Recto, against agreement of His Excellency Manuel A. Rojas and Archbishop Michael O'Doherty for the sale of the alleged estate owned by the Church for the price of P. 5,630,000.00 considering that the whole archipelago is owned by the predecessor of the said oppositor, evidence by OCT No. T-01. Dash 4, TCT number T408 and TCT number T498, and in truth Catholic. Land has been a subject of more donations by the oppositor's predecessors, which may terminate in a time upon convinced to any party contradictory to the purpose. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Date of inscription February 24, 1947. Annotation entry number GLRO 0117-S1948. Description deed of assignment covering an area of 15 hectares along Sap and Bagnoy, portion of Chrysostomo Estate has been assigned irrevocably to retired Major Eduardo Jusinus duly executed by Don Esteban. Date of inscription March 17, 1948. Benitez Tolano. 
Date of document February 4, 1948. Signed, Teodoro Gonzalez Register of Deeds. Annotation entry number GLR 01107-S59-19956. Description National Treasury of the Philippines under President Carlos P. Garcia administration submitted a promissory note of the national government to undertake the payment of P7 million.00 in favor of Don Esteban Benitez Tolano as payment of Barrera Reservoir, the La Mesa Dam and at least 300 hectares of land utilized by the national slash local government into roads highways and other infrastructures, that the owner is committed to release the corresponding titles of the land upon payment of the SID amount which will be derived from the reparation agreement signed at Malacanang between Philippines and Japan amounting to U.S. dollar two million point zero zero. Date of document May 10th, 1956. Signed, Jose D. Santos Register of Deeds. Date of inscription May 11th, 1956. Annotation entry number GLR 01108-S59-91957. Description entry number 01107 has been cancelled upon full payment of the national government obligation which was reduced to P300 million.00 to Don Esteban Benitez Tolano on May 7, 1957. Date of document May 7, 1957. Signed, OCD Santos Register of Deeds. Date of inscription May 10th, 1957. Tolano Foundation Documents. Please allow extra time for larger files to download. OCTT-01-4164 KB TCTT-408 25 KB, TCTT 498, 27 KB, 1972-02-04 Again a decision with compromise. Agreement 297 KB, 1974-03-21 Again a clarification order 82 KB. 1975-1104 Agana Decision Acopiado 214 KB 1976-01-19 Agana Clarification Decision 187 KB 1982-09-14 Certified True Copy of Entry of Judgment 52 KB 1989052823 third alias writ of execution with dismissal to motion for relief 166 KB 1989-1009 partial compliance with sheriff's certificate of return 48 KB 1996 Supreme Court and Bank decision retitle 4136975 KB 1997-0707 re yes order reconstituting November 4, 1975 decision 13 KB 1998-0202 re yes order reaffirming November 4, 1975 decision 15 KB 2001 0711 re yes order reconstituting previous orders with writs 26 KB 2001 re yes denial of solicitor general motion for reconsideration 26 KB 2002-06-07 Letter of Intent Julian Morden to Lano 616 
KB 2002-0625 Resolution Writ of Preliminary Injunction Against Alano Personally 19 KB 2004-0524 Foundation Manifestation by Attorney Vera 45 KB 2005-04 05SC Resolution Refall Sicopiado Claims 2005-04-13 Foundation Motion to Intervene by Attorney Peralta 22KB